the nation's largest prosecutor's office is moving to dismiss roughly 60 marijuana convictions, the latest step to undo what some reform advocates consider the damage caused by narcotics enforcement carried out before Californians voted to legalize marijuana, Los Angeles County Dist. Attorney George Gaskin announced Monday, under prior Dist. Jackie Lacey, the office moved last year to dump 66 marijuana convictions that took place before voters passed Proposition 64, the state law legalizing recreational marijuana use. But that list was compiled using information collected by the California Department of Justice, and Gaskin said his office was able to identify tens of thousands more eligible cases by combing L. A. County Court Records. Dismissing these convictions means the possibility of a better future to thousands of disenfranchised people who are receiving this long-needed relief, Gaston said in a statement. It clears the path for them to find jobs, housing and other services that previously were denied to them because of unjust cannabis laws. Gaskin has long championed efforts to reverse what he sees as the racially disparate and overly punitive impacts of the nation's war on drugs. While serving as San Francisco's top prosecutor, he sought the dismissal of nearly 9 000 felony and misdemeanor marijuana convictions that were processed prior to the passage of Proposition 64. Approximately 20 000 of the convictions expected to be expunged were for felony possession or cultivation of marijuana, according to Jean Bukshoni, a spokeswoman for the El County District Attorney's Office. The remaining were misdemeanors filed in jurisdictions that do not have their own city attorney's offices, she said.